Hello guys, welcome back. This is Kehes for After Effects tutorial channel. Today I want to show you how to track by Mocha After Effects on live action footage, then creating 3D element object on live action footage scene. So let's start. Create a new project, create a new composition from footage, select this video. So here is the video. I want to track this video into Boris Mocha effects. Go to animation, here is track in Boris FX Mocha, select and click on the logo Mocha, then wait. So there is the video and there is the Mocha After Effects. Here is the video. Select the Expand tool. I want to track this place. Then track forward. So here is completed. Track motion option. There is the transform, scale, rotation, skew, and perspective. We don't need the perspective point. Then there is the first layer of the track point. Go to file, save project, and close. So now right click, create a new null object, and select the video, and go to track data, and select the transform. Apply the export, so apply the keyframes of the tracking to null object and now apply export. So there is the null object. Play. Good. And now time to create new solid right here. 3D. Element 3D go to effects. Video copilot. Select the element 3D. So, before creating the 3D object, I want to save my project. Save the project and go to Scene Setup. So, now, I want to create the project tile weapons. Here is the A-Bomb. The A-Bomb, change the lighting 360 and press OK. So now right click create a new camera 24 press OK. Select the 3D and go to group 1. So go to particle look, change the size and go to particle replicator rotation. Rotate the bomb and press shift move forward and move it down here and press control rotate like this one move a little bit down move here and press control move a little bit up press control scale up the size and move it down and go to render setting go to lighting change to 360 and go to additional rotation here is so I want to reflect this environment to the model of 3D. So turn off and go to composition, save frame as file, save to desktop and then go to Photoshop, change to JPEG sequence and press render. So after render go back to scene setup, go to environment, environment and go to desktop. Select uh, this video. 
press OK and now press OK turn on again and change the direction of lighting here is the reflection of environment to the bomb so now create the shadow go back to scene setup and then um, go to create a plan make a huge plan and move it down select the second group press ok and close this one go to group one and go to particle replicator move the plan down press control go to rotation change to zero move down press control slowly Okay, go back to scene setup and then select the material presets, physical, apply the matte shadow material and press OK. Go to ambient occlusion, turn on, there is the shadow. So select the quality, 64 and close the group 2 go to group 1 and press control so slowly rotate the bomb here it is so now uh, let's Turn on the motion blur, make 350 and close, close this one, so close this one, go to lighting, press control. Here it is. Close again. Press Ctrl S for saving your project. And now, um, time to select the 3D layer and camera. Both right click pre compose right here. 3D bond and parent web to the null object. Turn on the motion blur. Render now. Here is the result of mocha tracking on vfx okay guys thank you for watching don't forget like and subscribe the channel see you next time